Today, we are excited uh, to celebrate baptism with Shelly uh, and love her family so much. And uh, just to tell you, if you're a family member of uh, Shelly, a uh, friend, I want to invite you to stand uh, there where you're at just as a, as, a, as a support for her. And this time, and I want to read a, a testimony that she shared. Uh, she said, I grew up going to church almost every weekend. Around late middle school, early high school, I went forward to my church to be baptized. I had lots of head knowledge on who God was, who Jesus was, and what baptism was, and so I thought I needed to be baptized. I thought because of my knowledge, that meant I was saved. Fast forward to my freshman year of college, and I came home for Christmas break, and my family and I decided to watch some home videos. We were all laughing when a video popped up of me verbally abusing one of my brothers and encouraging my sister to do the same. Up until that point, I truly thought I was a good person, but I... But in that moment, I was slapped in the face by my sin. I ran to the bathroom and started begging God to kill me. I couldn't bear my sin and what I'd just seen. And a few minutes later, my brothers, who just relived my abuse, came into the bathroom, hugged and kissed me, and said they forgave me. God physically showed me His grace through my brothers, and that's when He changed me. Since then, He's given me a new heart, and I truly, truly hate my anger and other sin that God reveals that I do. He's given me a hunger for Him and His Word. And even though I fell a lot, and we all do, don't we? That even though I fell a lot, I want to spend my life being obedient to Him. And that's why I'm following in believers' baptism today, to be obedient. And so praise the Lord uh, for your testimony. And I'm gonna I'm gonna sit this here and, and uh, Shelly and I were just sharing a few moments ago, and said how it's been ten years uh, since she truly repented of her sin and placed her faith and trust in Christ, and it's never too late to obey the Lord. And so Shelly, I have one question to ask you: Have you accepted Jesus Christ as the Lord of your life? Yeah. Amen. Well, it's on that profession of faith that I baptize you, my sister, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried in the likeness of his death, and raised to walk in newness of life. Praise the Lord! Yes!